was once a boy who was never afraid, but he he had not enough sense to be scared. That's me. One day, Hans and his big sister were walking home after dark. The wind howled and the trees creaked and groaned. The road bled past a graveyard where the moon lit up rows of tombstones. Hans just began to quiver and quake. Ooh, this place gives me the willies. The willies? What are the willies? Do I have to tell you everything? The willies are when you get scared and shiver and shake. Well, I never wished I had. I never had anything like that. I wish I could get the willies, so I know what to be like. The more he thought it over, the more he wondered about the willies, and the more he wished he could have them. One day, he told himself, "Hmm, I want the willies. I better go look for them." So he said goodbye to his family. What a fool! I cannot believe he has them. Or mine. <laughs> and started down the road. Hans walked for many days. Everyone he met, he asked, Can you give me the willies? Many tried. Yeah. But none of it. At last he came to the king's castle and stood before the king. Your majesty, can you give me the willies? Of course I can. I'm the king. The king waved his royal scepter. I command you to have the willies. Hans, Hans waited, but nothing happened. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I still don't have them. Oh, well, at least I know where you can get them. On the other side of my kingdom is a haunted castle. If you spend the night there, you are sure to get the willies. Wow, thank you, Your Majesty. There's just one problem. No one who goes there ever lives through the night. But if you stay alive and break the spell, you'll find the castle treasure. That's fine with me, as long as I get the willies. <laughs> it was midnight when Hans reached the castle. The tower's eerie shadow under the full moon. The drawbridge lowered itself at a hand's feet. Creak. This seems like a friendly place. As Hans entered the great hall, a fire sprang to life in the huge breakfast room. Hans pulled up a chair and settled himself to wait. Now I'm sure to get the willies. The clock is the, in the great hall struck one. Bum. A voice boomed up behind him. Welcome. Hans looked around and saw two men playing cards. One had a long black cloak and the other had a furry face. Would you care to join our game? It's been so long since we had anyone to play with. Hans took a seat. Certainly, it will pass the time while I'm waiting for the willies. I will explain the rules. If my furry friend wins, he will rip your shreds. If I win, I will drink your blood. If you win, we, we will let you live. Sounds fair to me. Oh. <laughs> the very man dealt the cards. They played up for almost an hour. In the end, the cold man won. I want to drink your blood. <laughs> he moved closer to Hanj, showing two long, pointy teeth. I think you cheated. Hans reached for the pointy teeth and broke them off. Snap! Ow! And out of the hall the ran, ran the man. The furry man leaped at Hans, but Hans sprang away and the man flew past right out an open window. Ah! Hans heard a dull thud. Then he went. Then he went and settled himself again before the fire. I enjoyed the game, but when do I get the willies? The clock struck two. Bong, bong. Hans heard a, heard a rattling. And into the hall marched a long line of skeletons. The first skeleton snapped its finger. The second skeleton knocked its knees, clack, clack. The third skeleton drummed its skull, clock, clock. The fourth skeleton tapped along along the ri its ribs, little tune, quickly, clackly, clock. 
Click any platform. Nice B. The other skeletons formed a circle and started to dance. One skeleton stretched a hand towards him. Hans. Hmm, don't mind if I do. Hans took hold, hold of two bony hands and danced in a circle in the hall. Hey, this is fun! The music got faster. Clackety, clackety, click, clack, clackety. Clackety, clackety, click, clack, clackety. Hold it, I can't dance this fast! <laughs> but the skeletons gripped his hands harder and danced even faster. Clickety, clackety, clickety, clackety, clickety, clackety, clickety, clackety. I said, hold it! Hans gave a yank and pop. The two skeletons' arms came up right off. The music and the dancing stopped. I think you lost something. <laughs> <laughs> the skeleton rushed as Hans and started jumping on him. Hans grabbed the chair and swung it. It's it this way and that. Crash, bash. Bones flew here and there everywhere. So the skeletons lay in pieces on the floor. Hans gathered them up and tossed them in, out the window. Then settled himself once again before the fire. I like a little dancing, but I wonder where I'm going to get the wheelies. The clock struck three. Bong, bong, bong. From the chimney came down a deep voice. Look out below. Something huge came falling down the square. The tube missed the fire and thump landed before the fireplace. It was a giant body with no arms or legs or head. Look out below! Thump, 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 thump. Two giant legs, two giant arms extended next to it. Look out below! Thump. A, a giant head landed by the, rep, by the rest. I get it! It's a puzzle! And I have to put it together! <laughs> Hans used the two giant legs and struck, stuck them into the body. Snap, snap. Hey! It was the giant's head talking. You got, you got the shoes pointing out. Oh, I'm sorry. He switched the legs. Snap, 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 snap. Then he, t then he stuck on. He stuck the arms up in the head. Snap, snap, snap. The giant, the giant jumped up. The spell is broken. You are the only one ever to get me together. The others all died in a fright long before this. Now follow me to the castle treasure. Hans followed him to the doorway. You first. After you. The giant led him into the courtyard and pointed to a shovel under a tree. Dig there. You dig there. The giant dug until he uncovered three pots of gold. Take them inside. You take them inside! The giant took the pots of gold and set them down in the great hall. One is for the king, one is for the poor, and one is for you. Then he flew into pieces again and flew up the chimney. First the head, then the arms and legs, then the giant one. Some folks just can't keep themselves together! Hans went back to his chair before the fire. Girls in it again inside. Uh, it's nice to be rich, but when will I ever get the willies? And that is how Hans stayed alive, broke the spell and found the treasure. When the king heard the tale, he let Hans live in a castle and when he, Hans grew up, he married king's, the king's daughter. Within a year, they had triplets. Three fond sons. Dearest, would you like to name them? Certainly. Their names will be Willie, Willie, and Willie. But why all the same? Because now we'll have the Willies.